hi people welcome back to my youtube channel and welcome back to another video in this video i wanted to be reacting to a ghanaian youtuber nigerian ghanaian youtuber do you understand i don't know if you get what i'm saying nigerian based in ghana that was a youtuber reacting to a nigerian based in nigeria that went to kai that went to kenya for you know maybe vacation so the person just went to ghana tra I, I mean went to kenya traveled there to go and you know go and hard food you know something like that so this video is a double reaction double or triple the the kenya and um, the youtuber that vlog in kenya do a reaction about about kenya and a nigeria based in ghana react to a reactor like a video react to a video and i in nigerian based in nigeria reacting to ghana based youtuber video slash the woman that actually react to the kenya video this is triple one okay i'm the third person here okay so first of all the video i actually watched is the video of the ghana youtuber so i'm sure i'll be writing the name yeah i'll be writing the name so the first thing she said there that's where i actually get to know what the kenya lady did in the like what she did that she was reacting to because i wasn't the kenya youtuber subscriber but i am the subscriber of the ghana youtuber yeah can i say i'm a subscriber and i'm a viewer i'm a viewer though <laughs> okay let me say i'm a viewer i'm a viewer i always get to see a video every single time so i just I always click, I always watch, yeah. So not everything, no, I don't watch all, but some that I feel like I should watch. And it may actually lead me to reacting, just like it's doing now. That's what's always happened. It always come and lead me to reacting. Anyways, so the first thing there, that the first point that she mentioned there that I want to react to is, see, she is actually asking the, um, the Nigeria YouTuber, a fellow Nigeria YouTuber that went to Ghana to visit I mean, that went to visit Kenya. I'm just repeating Ghana. I mean, Kenya, that went to visit Kenya. So she was advising her to apologize to Ghana and Kenya because it will affect her as a Nigerian when she goes to Kenya. So what she was saying here is that because of what the lady did, so when she goes to Kenya, this will, this is going to affect her. Like, people of Kenya will be using that phase of what the lady did since the lady is a nigerian to be judging anything about her as well to be reacting to her you understand me first of all this point i find it like selfish something oh my god it took quiet. so i find it like selfish thing like you've been too selfish that you're actually only thinking about what they will say like you're not thinking about the lady feeling as well the woman that did the video that had to the video you're not thinking about her feelings so you are saying she's supposed to apologize like isn't she being intentional even if it's not like that if it's for like content you know i will still get to there i think i've not gotten to there but i'm think i'm jumping so let me just take it slow so i think this point I don't like it. Feel like selfish. You are only thinking about yourself. You don't think about the person that did the video. You don't even know anything. What she said is what you are reacting to. Based on what you are actually trying to see there is that what she said to Ghana and Nigeria, she said something like maybe negativities. There is no country that doesn't have negativities and positivities. So she's been saying, she's the one that has been saying the positivities. So she see the negativities as well and she talk about it. So why does she have to apologize? Does she have to apologize to Nigerian as well for like okay? If you say she so she should apologize for saying something bad, what about you? Are you not supposed to apologize to Nigeria as Nigeria that you are for all the negativities you've been saying about Nigeria? Before you actually tell somebody something, if you want to advise someone, first of all, look at yourself, check yourself very well. Like what this person is doing, am I not also doing that kind of thing? Like you can't just you can't judge the person that was doing exactly what you are doing, where you don't even know how to judge yourself. So that part, I, I don't like it. The point. The second one is that she observed. She said she observed someone offended her in the comment section. So that's why she's packing all people of Kenya together in the video. 
So she said to her own observation, no. She observed that someone actually offended her in the comment section. And that's always happened. Yeah, especially when it's Ghana and Nigeria. Ghana are the most people that usually come and insult, bringing negative energy. They are the one. As in Kenya too, they said they did well. I think all over with the world, Nigeria needs to start, you know. I don't know, but one thing I know for sure is that at the end of the day, our high weekly, yeah. It's been like this. It doesn't mean it's going to be like this forever. So you that you are in the front, don't sit. like Don't just sit and you feel like you have already reached day. No. At any fucking time, even though the backward one, the last position of a position, or what are they calling that one? English. So they can actually take the first position from you and you, and you will go back to the back. So that's why we should always be careful. Yeah, don't just think and just base everything you are doing on because of the presence. You understand what I'm trying to say? Don't base everything on the presence. Try and be thinking about the future of small, small as well, you know? So you can just imagine because of what is going on now, people shouting, it's happening everywhere. Like, you can't just use that. You are saying she's she's judging them based on what few people said in the comment section, Right? Are they not judging Nigeria entirely based on what few people do? Like, what few people do bad? Few people that were doing something bad. Are they not, are they not packing Nigeria together because of it? So that, there's no point in that, sister. There's no point. I don't see any point there. It's the same thing they are doing. So you don't have to be bears like that. You're having bears like just, you know, trying to just make them feel like you are real or something like that. It's still getting more like Getting more and more looking like fake to me. Like, what's that? And I don't want to say that. I'm talking about what the Ghanaian based YouTuber was saying about the Kenya person that reacts to Kenya, about Kenya, what's going on about Kenya. So she talked about phone snatching in Kenya. So the lady actually said that they are snatching phone in Kenya. So she now claimed, the Ghana YouTuber now claimed that snatching phone, where did they snatch phone pass? Like, where did they snatch phone the most? Where they snatched phone? I mean, I'm saying snatch instead of snatch. <laughs> the most in the world. If she haven't experienced it in Nigeria, that means she's been knowing her way. She's trying to avoid digits. Very, she's been very careful. That's why she hasn't experienced it in Nigeria. Bro, this snatching phone. I heard about it and it's probably in lagos that was some years back yeah it's very very common at that time but not presently now i know they may still be snatching from it's going to be everywhere but it's not as you claim as you said it in the video like hey, tell me where they snatch from passing the word bro this uh -uh. stop at this word Stop it. Even if you're, if someone offended you in Nigeria, if someone offended you in Nigeria, or maybe based on your experience or family, something, I don't know. You don't have to just be just using, passing the, and uh, this thing on everyone and just painting, painting everyone black in this country because you want them to see you as nice person. That's what it feels like. That's what you're doing. Like, seriously. She says it's the snatch phone. They snatch phone everywhere. Even in Ghana that you claim they snatch phone. Then they come and comment and tell me if they don't snatch phone in Ghana. They snatch phone everywhere. So everything they are doing here that is of negativities, they are doing it everywhere too. Everywhere. It can be much more than themselves. And because, I swear, because we as Nigeria, we don't, most of Nigeria do not love their own country as well. Just like you. Well, I know you will claim you love your country. <laughs> you can't love your country and be painting your country black. Even if you don't, like, if you don't have anything to say, like, you are not supposed to just bring out be getting, trying to make things get worse, looking more bad. They already say you as bad people, but you are still bringing out things, trying to just paint it more and make it still look more, more expanded, like, expand. I don't, I don't, I don't just, I don't get that one. So, her other one she said is that she said she's coming for she's coming for them because 
because she said their country is beautiful so they want to put our own country black they want to put our own country down okay what she's talking about is that when she's been praising kenya some kenya people are painting nigerian black they are saying bad bad things and turning nigeria nigerian their wife was actually praising them and promoting their own country that typical ghanaian i don't know that kenya people are also like that kenya are you people like that as well like are you people like that as well we call ourselves africa like but you only see nigeria as your fellow african country when there is something good news very big news about this country like when something like that happen i see that ah, this is a very good thing that's when you claim i feel like but if not you all kenya and Ghana, you will feel like you are not you are not related to yourself you are you know you just feel like you don't want them they are just you know especially ghana yeah even though in the video that she did ghana had the most people that was on the comment section of that video and still praising that kind of even though, though some Kenya that I saw there that comment that or doing that thing, they actually like the same thing as Kenya. Yeah. Because how do you talk, even in the comment section, they talk normal, like we love in Nigeria and somewhere like and it's not like that. Gonna, if it's if it's Ghana, Ghana will be bullying. That's what they do. But they are not really insulting. Yeah, they are trying to just explain and don't say one or two things. I think they are very, very much smart. Yeah. So, another thing is that, another thing she said is that um, she did it because she wants to get her people back to Nigeria. What she's trying to say is that when she has already arrived in Nigeria, in Nigeria back, so she's trying to get her people back, not to be saying she's talking bad about Nigeria, so you are praising them, you are doing this, so that's why she's saying what those things she's saying. If you say she's saying it because of that, is it not true? Isn't it what she experienced? Are you there with her? <laughs> that is the question. Can you answer those questions? Because I don't get that one that you are not there. You don't know what is happening. You don't know what she faced. But you are there challenging what she said. Like, <sighs> come on. And another one is that she asked her to apologize to, okay, I already said this. She asked her to apologize to Canada. If she was her, ah, she was going to apologize to Ghana. To Kenya and Ghana. <laughs> Bro. But you are not her. Ah, and she's not you. <laughs> so you are not the same people. So you can't even tell her. You can't tell a, ma like, a mature person what to do. If she wanted to apologize, it's her choice. You don't have to drag her to do so. Even though if you want to talk to her, like... <laughs> you also can DM her. She have Instagram. She have other social media and do that. You can go there and talk to her. Why do you have to be making public figure about it? If it's not that you are trying to make, um, you are trying to be like a nice person, the real one. If that is not what you are actually imagining and doing and trying to do, I don't see any reason why you have to come publicly to come and be announcing that to the whole world to see that she did this. What's that? That's hypocrite. And I don't want that. I don't want that she said is that she believed that she was saying the truth when she says positive things. Okay. So she said that when she was saying everything, all the positivities that she's been saying, all of them believed, including her. She personally really believed her. But when she now said the negativities that was going on there, she don't believe her. Can you imagine? But you believe the positivities and you don't believe the negativities. Everything comes there in like the two ways, like positivities and negativities. So when there is neg um, positivities, you don't expect negativities. You must be kidding. If you don't believe, well, people that believe, believe. And people that doesn't believe, doesn't believe. And for me, it's none of my business though. Yeah. <laughs> me, I believe what she said. Is either the positivities or negativities because someone cannot come and be lying like she can't just not see something about it or experience it and just come online and carry camera and be filming what she doesn't experience it's not possible so i believe it i believe it is you that doesn't believe it a few people that doesn't believe it so if she still come and apologize as well for viewing pleasure well that's fine it's a choice but you don't talk to people like that though yeah and another one is that she said if she was 
if she was the best thing to do, okay, if she was ah, the best thing to do is to apologize. She should say sorry. Oh, she don't know what she was doing. She was doing and she was overreacting because of few people talking ill of her country. Can you imagine? Why don't you also apologize, Mrs. Ghana YouTuber Nigeria? You're supposed to apologize to Nigeria as well that you don't know what you are doing. You know, you are, since you have been talking heel of Nigeria to promote Ghana, you don't know what you are doing. So they should forgive you because you are overreacting. You are supposed to do that. Like you should put the, you should lead. If you want to tell someone to do something like, oh my goodness, you have to lead. You have to lead that person. Give them a way. Like the role model that you have, show them we do it first. When you do it, yes, we know that you're talking. Then they will also try and do it. So the another one said that if she goes somewhere and she doesn't like it, she won't talk about it or post for the for the sake of peace. So that's what we've been doing in Ghana. You have been saying everything good that is going on in Ghana. But you have that means that you have already you have been seeing something that is negative. It's a lot. You have experienced a lot of the issue that you don't even want to talk about because you, you want to make peace because you want them to be seeing you as nice person, great person, the person that doesn't betray them, the person that like them for real. They want, you want them to be seeing you that you are real, you are the real one. So that is the reason why you've not been talking about it. You just said it now. So, but you've been talking about what you see bad here in Nigeria and you never talk about the, what you don't like in Nigeria is what you have been talking about. You don't talk about what you like about Nigeria. I've not seen you talking about that one. Can you just make a special video about it? Like, at least we know that you are talking at that time. That's when I was started to, like, I will start to be believing you as well. I personally, don't let me lie to you, I don't believe you, most of your video. Because they seems like they are fake to me, like, you know, but I just feel like, let's hear her out. I'm so sorry, but that's the truth. Yeah, anything you do, anything you say, though it may seem like maybe they do it, but you exaggerate it. You make it look much more than what it is. So that's why I don't really get into it. I just watch like, what? Well, anyhow, maybe because I just, I just like listening to you though. So that's why I watch. And another one is, she said, real love doesn't last forever. So, is fake love that lasts? I'm asking, I'm asking you, fake love lasts forever, right? You know why she's talking about that one is because <laughs> some people are actually being real to her and saying, okay, yes, that's true, go, go, go. So, you want her to live in fake, to be living fake life, just like you've been doing fake things as well. So, you want her to be, to be your second person, to also be doing it fake. Well... It's, ma it's a matter of choice. If she wish to, she can. And as she said that, she said they would think she's doing video about them for views. Okay. You know what she's actually talking about is that um, the Kenya people would think she was doing video about them for viewing, pleasure for the viewing, for viewers, for people to view. So as well as ah, as a Nigerian based in Ghana, so they will be thinking she's doing video for views. But the question is, are you not doing video for views? Are you just doing video for, <laughs> why don't you be putting them private since you're not doing it for view, so that people will love you? Like, I wouldn't have seen it if you have also posted it in like private, you understand? I don't get you. Like, she's doing it for view. The reaction you did now, are you not doing it for view? That your reaction that I'm reacting to as well. Were you not doing it for view? You were doing it for view, probably, definitely. Because you can easily just correct her some out uh, another way. Like you can just go to a DM and just tell her that, oh, you should do this. Or you both should chat and talk like race sisters from Nigeria. It's not a matter of carrying camera and coming to public and come and be doing video that. You should apologize, trying to make people feel like you are the real one. Trying to just, all you are doing there is like trying to excuse yourself from what she's doing. Like, just because, like, trying to just make them see you as someone that is different and special. So you are not associated. That's one thing you're trying to do. Being lawyer, like, lawyer, that. 
I don't know. You're older than me. You are either, like elder either sister to me, yeah. But this is YouTube, and we are YouTubers. So you say your own what you think as a reaction. So I said my own as my own reaction as well. We are reactors, reactors everywhere. You understand? So, anyways, that's what I can. Oh my god, that's what I think about this video. That's my perspectives about the entire thing. I pictured it because I don't want. I don't even watch the video of the lady. Yeah. There are some kind of video that I will play and it will not feel like it's interesting to me. So, I don't have to force myself. You understand? But, anyhow. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching. And I'm going to see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.